Hello friends. This video is brought to you by MyWayTeaching.com. For different requirements from a data, other measures of central tendencies are required. And mode is another measure of central tendency or another form of representative values. The mode of a set of observations is defined as the observation that occurs most often. Let us take up this example and try to understand the definition of mode and also the need for mode. This is a record maintained by a shopkeeper who sells shirts. He kept a record of the sale of sizes of shirt. In one week, he sold total 105 shirts, out of which 8 shirts were of 90 inches, 22 shirts were of size 95 inches, 32 shirts of size 100 inches, 37 shirts of size 105 inches, and 6 shirts of size 110 inches. Looking at the data collected by him, he came to the conclusion that he must order more shirts of 105 inches. And we can say that mode for this information is 105 inches as 105 is the observation that occurs maximum number of times. Let us also discuss here why we required mode and why mean could not serve the purpose. Suppose if we had calculated the mean for this information, it would be total number of shirts which is 105 divided by the number of observations 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 whole divided by 5 which would give us 21 and that would mean that the shopkeeper and that would mean that shopkeeper should order 21 shirts of each size Now it is for you to decide whether it would be wise for the shopkeeper to use mean and order the shirts or use mode to order the shirts. If he orders 21 shirts of all sizes, he won't be able to fulfill the requirement of 100 inch and 105 inch shirts while he will be in overstock of 90 inches and 110 inches shirts. Hence we can say that use of mode would be better measure of central tendency by the shopkeeper and his stock must have more of 105 inches and 100 inches shirt then 90 and 110 inches shirts let us read the question find the mode of the given set of numbers let us rearrange our data and arrange the numbers with the same values together we will get 1 1, 1, 3 times, then 2, 2, 2, and 2, 4 times, 3, 1 time, and 
force two times now according to the definition of mode it is the set of observation that occurs most often and in this data we can see that two is occurring maximum number of times so we can say that mode of this data is two because it occurs most frequently than other observations